Today I'm going to have a go at documenting one of my workouts. So I've got the next percents in the car. These are the shoes of choice for today's workout. So I usually do short um, intervals on Mondays and then I do longer intervals on Wednesdays. So today's session is 20 times 400 meters. So quite a lot of reps, um, but then short intervals of 400 meters with 30 seconds rest, standing rest between each one. So the plan is to take a short drive to basically a nice flat road. Um, there's some nice fresh tarmac there, measure out 400 meters and get the job done really. It's a hard workout, but I'm looking forward to it. Um, and this is the first time I've ever tried to film one of these, um, one of my workouts. So I'm not sure quite how it's gonna go yet, but bear with me, hopefully in the next few weeks as I do more of them, I can get Meg out to come and film some of them. Um, they'll get a bit better. But yeah, today's workout 20 times 400 meters, which is a workout I like to do in, for my half marathon speed and probably a 10, so it's more of a 10 to half marathon type workout. Um, so I'm not going flat out for these 400 meters like I would be if I was training for a 5K. Um, they're more like 80% efforts um, just to get my body used to that speed for a half marathon, which is the plan for, I think, my race is in October. I'm blabbing on a bit now, but anyway, let's get into it. The workout. I've got a race in October, and this is a workout I like to do to build my half marathon speed. Hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave a like, subscribe, and all that jazz. Uh, we're moving house at the end of this week as well. Moving to Hattie P, Hatfield Peveril. Um, moving in with a few friends from uni. So that's exciting things. I think I'll document a bit on the channel. But yeah, other than that, it's time to get going and get the workout done. There we go, watch just started. 3K warm up, then into the workout. Two K, four eighteen pace. There we go. Three K warm up in the bag. It's a Monday, so the body's feeling nice and fresh. I tend to have Sundays as my day off. So when it comes to the speed sessions on the Monday, I'm feeling nice and fresh. Taking along there at around 4.15 pace for the warm-up, 3K. Yeah, body's feeling good. Time for a few strides, stretches, get the, um, the next percent on and give this workout a good go. That's the workout done. 20 times 400. It's a bit of a crash and burn workout. Went out too fast. Suffered for it a bit. But held out. Overall, good effort. Another one back. Let's have a look at the stats when we get back home. Whew. So yeah, that's the workout done. Now to swap the shoes back over and to get this 3K cool down and then I'll have a look at the stats when I get home. So I'm back from the run. Now I'm gonna have some lovely soup and a load of bread to, uh, to replenish all of those calories I just burnt. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, so I'm back from the workout. I'm just having a little look through on Strava and um, see how the session went. 
So it was 20 times 400 meters with 30 seconds standing rest. Um, it's the first time I've done this workout with 30 seconds. Usually I do it with maybe 45 or a minute. So those recoveries are really short. Um, could barely catch my breath in those recoveries actually. So it was quite a difficult workout. Um, here the, you can see the splits. So there's 20, these peaks here, each one of them is a rep, so 400 meters. The first one I went off far too quick, probably the, the fact that I had a camera there, so there's video in it. So it was around that 245 per kilometer pace, so that's anaerobic for me. Um, so using, um, my body was using more oxygen than it can intake in the first five reps. For the last remaining 16, I got to about 10 reps here and I was absolutely dying thought about maybe pausing the watch and having a little bit longer with the recoveries but I stuck with it with the 30 seconds um, and yeah overall it was a pretty good workout um, if we go over to the laps it will show you the 400 meters so here's the first one in 67 seconds so that was a really fast one um, <clears throat> then 70 seconds then 71 then 72 so the first five are really quick and then the last ones, if you look down here, the last one was uh, 75 seconds, so 308, still not bad speed, that's still around my target 5k pace, so a good workout, um, I'm glad I stuck with it. Let's have a look at the pace distribution, um, so as you can see here there's 15, 16 minutes total there spent in uh, either zone 5 or zone 6, so that's really good speed endurance type stuff so that will really help with sort of half marathon 10k training I'm hoping. If we go back to the overview let's have a look at the cadence for these reps. Um, so the cadence was around 192 so that's really quick turnover for me. Um, 184 on the reps so I wasn't going quite as quick but still that's a really good cadence um, which will help my leg turnover hopefully improve my running economy over time. Um, but yeah, that's the workout really. Started a bit too quick, but overall kept maintained the effort. So 400 repeats are a really good one um, that you can apply to any sort of training plan really. So this was a workout for a half marathon, so 20 reps with 30 with short recoveries. If you're looking at, I've done this workout for when I was training for a 5k PB. I did a lot less reps, so around that 10 to 12 reps with slightly longer um, recoveries. So, and, and slightly faster, so you get a little bit longer to recover from um, the speed. But yeah, hopefully I'll see the benefits of that sort of um, speed workout. I do that every sort of Monday. On Wednesday I do a longer speed um, interval session. So this week I've got uh, 20 times 2 minutes with 20 second recovery. So it's a very similar session to this one actually. And then on Saturday or Sunday I've got 8 by a K with a kilometre jog recovery so a little bit longer session there I um, hope you found this video interesting subscribe to the channel I'll see you around soon moving house next week so that's something to look forward to and hopefully I'll video some of it on the channel um, yeah thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon bye